This is a thickness planer or just a plane, a planer, uh, either name, uh, they're, they're equivalent. And one of the problems you have with a thickness planer is called snipe. Snipe is a term for the, the board goes through the planer and there are two rollers, one before the blade, then the blade, then a second roller after the blade. The rollers hold the piece of wood down tight to the bed uh, while the blades are spinning on the wood. Well, when you reach the end of the board, this end comes out from under this rearmost roller while the plane, planer blades are still in contact with the wood. And so the back, and, and then the front is still, front roller is still pushing down. So what happens is the back tends to come up because there's no longer downward pressure on it. And when it comes up, the, uh, the planer blades dig a trough that goes across the board and you're left with an imperfection. So you want to figure out how to prevent that from happening. Uh, there are two ways that I'm going to show you to prevent that. First one I'm going to show you is absolutely foolproof. It works every time, but you have to have a second piece of wood which is really sacrificial in order to prevent the snipe on the first piece of wood. So that's what I'm going to demonstrate and the way first and that, and the way that works is that I will put this board into the planer and you see you'll see the rollers pull it through and I will butt this up against it so that it goes in right afterwards and the effect this has is that this roller will stay on this thickness of wood clear through this whole board and so there will be no snipe on this board you will potentially have a problem with snipe on this board because uh, of, the, of the same sort of issue. You could, you could actually bring this board around. If, you're, if, if, the, if the boards are long enough, you could uh, use these same two pieces to prevent snipe on both. These aren't long enough, but you can do that if you have a longer one. So let me demonstrate that. I have to turn on uh, a dust collector to pick up the chips and I have to uh, turn on the machine itself. Both of these are noisy and I'll talk to you on the flip side here. So if you examine these two boards, you'll see that there's no snipe whatsoever. That is a foolproof method of preventing snipe. Now I'm going to show you a method that only requires this one piece of wood, but it requires some touch on your part. And you've seen it uh, coming out, and it comes off of this tray. If you put your hand under here and give slight pressure up, only slight pressure up, it will keep the back of the board from coming up and prevent snipe. But it takes some practice and some touch to do that. Let me demonstrate that. Again. So there I demonstrated preventing snipe on this board without using the second board. Again, the method using two boards is foolproof, and I recommend it. If you don't want to use the wood or you don't have the extra wood, then you need to learn this technique where you just give some upward pressure as it comes off of the table. So if you like what you saw, please hit the like button. And if you want to be kept informed of our content, then please subscribe.